up is that these days show that's done in a fun and wacky way. Um, of course, these days, so many startups pop up here and there and everywhere. And the thing about them is that they all want to become a unicorn. Now, why I say this is because unicorns are billion dollar valuation companies and they're not many of those back then, but then now they're becoming more and more frequent. I think it's really because we're starting to see that the unicorn really does exist. They're fat and gray and they're called rhinoceros. <coughs> no? No? Oh, you don't like that? Okay. Endangered species. Two too, too sensitive, too sensitive. Anyways, we have an awesome show for you today. We have two startups, one being Carbon Kale, a service that helps you find better mechanics. Armin Banyas is the CEO, he's with us today. And we have Jazz Tan from Youth Today, helping young people realize their dreams. That's right. That's coming up next, but for now, we're gonna go for today's lingo. So the idea is that there's so many jargons coming out in the startup world that, um, you know, we <laughs> just tend to forget what they are. So uh, we thought we'd help you out by defining them for you. The uh, word of the day is, what is it? Advertainment. Ad ad advertainment? What's that? Let's figure it out. It could work. Maybe. Come on, all you have to do is say yes. I don't know. It's not gonna hurt, I promise. Man, I need some time. This is a big step, you know. Man up, man. I need space, la. All you gotta do is take a peek. Just, just take a peek. Okay, fine. Awesome. I've got to admit, it has potential. Ah? Uh, so it's a yes? It's just that... Just that... It's just that... Yes? Why does it always have to be on paperweight? <laughs> God, I told you! This is our golden ticket to Cyberjaya! Oh. And what? People will buy this based on some... What do you call that again? Adverts? Advertorial, man. Advertainment. Okay, what's the difference? You see, adverts are typical advertisements, mm -hmm. right? Advertorials are specifically paid content to make it look like it's a real story or a blog post. And people is going to believe in that stuff. I mean, dude, an ad is an ad, you know. Hey, you'll be surprised, huh? I mean, if you come to think of it, people don't really care once they've engaged in a story. They don't mind being pitched a product. Really? Yeah, really. So this afternoon, you and Surfer Dude has been working on your blog post. That was part of your campaign? You got that right. Okay. I don't know. This sounds too easy. I mean, who reads a story about paperweights? <laughs> I would. What was that? I don't know. But it proves I'm right. People will love it. I don't know. Dude, it's really cool. Whoa, when, when was he here? He was always there. Wait, wait, wait. But I was here a while ago and I didn't see him here. I don't know, maybe you're blind. Ah, uh, okay, okay, you know what? Never mind. How sure are you that your plan is going to work? Hmm? What is your backup plan? What if we don't make any sales? What if we don't uh, have any... Uh, 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 stop with the cues and the FAQs, man. I mean, trust me. I got it all planned out. And that's why I'm so worried. You are so obsessed with this paperweight thing. And I'm not the only one. I love paperweights. <laughs> Seriously, what's with him? That guy is one of our potential customers. One of our many potential customers. <sighs> Maybe. Listen, I'll sweeten the deal for you, okay? Okay. If you say yes, I'll um, start calling you hipster guy. Wait, what? Really? Wait, wait, wait. Is that even possible? 
well, you, you know, that guy over there, who's the producer, and he's sort of nodding, I think that's a yes. <laughs> uh, okay, it's a deal. I knew you'd come around, hipster guy. Dude. Thanks, I think. Yeah.